Are you ready to roll the dice? Thank you for coming to my channel. This is much to certain uh, for WBIF World Individual Championship. My opponent is Edward. Edward Nazarian from Georgia. Okay, let's get started. So I started with 6-2. Of course, I chose split and down. It's a basic of basic in backgammon. And then 2-3, okay. I want to hit outside instead of hitting loose. Now he secured the advanced anchor, which is pretty good for him. Okay, of course, I'm happy to make my 5 point. Running is also option, but yeah, making the 5 point must be better. Now, I see many target checkers, but I can't hit. So I just unstuck my heavy midpoint and heavy my 6 point. He's very happy to make his 5 point. Okay, 5-4. I can't come out, so my only reasonable choice is making the ace point. Uh, or do I? Can I hit loose? Uh, no, I don't think so. The damage of getting hit is too big. Double three. Okay, so he can make his bar point. Now, he completes a 4 prime, which is pretty good. 4 1. I can't come out. Do I hit? Do I hit? Uh, probably no. Uh, I, because his position is dynamic, so I want to do some uh, temp hit, but. Yeah, damage of getting hit is very pretty big. Okay. Now it's time to do a temp hit. I don't like I don't like my four, but I don't have any other choice. Oh wow. It's a tremendous joker. Three six from the bar. I fear I'm a dead man. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Of course, he can uh, make the three point. I danced. So obviously, this is a too good. Too good to double. Now, I need to roll a two. Yes, it's very important. Nope. So he's happy to attack me. Let's roll the two. Yes! Great! I love this. And he danced. So I got the chance to make the anchor. Come on! Okay. Still, I have a chance to make the anchor. So making the anchor is so important for me. Come on! Any two! Nope. Okay. Still he can't attack me. He made the bar point. Is it true? I don't think so. Anyway, let's roll a two. Ah, no. Okay, still he can't attack me. He's bringing down builders. Okay. Yes, I can do that! Now, now he's attacking with a 4. Okay, let's do that. Now, oh, still he can't cover. Alright, how many times I got the chance? <sighs> hmm, alright. He completes a close out. Yep, so my 3 back checkers are on the bar. So if I don't hit him. Yeah, he's almost guaranteed to win a gammon. So 
So the chance I hit him is pretty pretty small. Yeah, it, I say it's less than 10%. Yeah. So 6-5 is bad for him. Okay. No problem with the 5-4. Any ace is bad for him. 4-2 is reasonable. Really? I think just Korea from the rear is better. Now he has six uh, six bad numbers. 6-1-5-1-4-1. Okay. No problem at all. All right. Still he has five bad numbers. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Now I want to come in to avoid backgammon. All right. Oh, now I'm relieved to avoid backgammon. So his score is now two, uh, which is eleven away, and I'm thirteen away. This is much to 13. So he had a good start. Okay. Now we start the second game. He started with 5 1. I'm happy to make my 4 point. And, okay, he can't make the advanced anchor because of my 4 point. Alright, I wanna hit outside. Nope. So do I hit on the three point? Yeah, I think so. Hit and unstack the midpoint. He danced. Do I double? Okay, I have uh, five check. No, 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 no. Nine checkers in the zone. So if I cover my three point and he dances, the game will be over. Okay. Let's offer the cube. Yeah, especially because I'm behind in the score. I'm happy to uh, offer a cube. Okay, let's cover my three point. And wow, it's one of his best dice. But my double two is also pretty good. Yeah, so I make the golden point instead of covering the 11 point. Now I want to cover my 11 point. 6 3. Oh, what is this? What is this? I think I don't need to hide my blood because he doesn't want to hit me. It's too dangerous for him. Yeah, he avoided hitting me. Sure. So 2 1. Okay. Now, what I want to do, I want to leave my anchor. So any 7 will be good for me. 6-5. Can I choose uh, double falcon? Oh, but I, the race is almost even. The race is almost even. So what can I do? So one choice is two men down. And another choice is double falcon. Yeah, I think double falcon is good. Let's do that. Free one, he can do hit and uh, yeah, fill the ace point. Yep, he chose that. Oh, I danced. Six one, he can make the bar point. So four six double five is my joker. Okay. Yeah, it, it's fine. Yeah, it's much better than dancing. Three two is not his best. Okay, wow, 3-6 is, uh, it's, a, it's very great, it's a great dice for me. But the, the trouble is that I am behind in the race. Yeah, so making the 11 point uh, was pretty good for me. Then what do I do? Okay, let's clear my mid uh, midpoint. While he has an inner blood. Oh, he hits me. Yeah, sure, of course, he has to hit me. Wow. Now I'm gonna win a game or I'm gonna win a gammon. So the question is do I attack on my five point or hit outside? 
is a place attractive? I think hitting outside is fine because he has a stronger home board. Okay, wow. That 5 was very important for him. I don't want to avoid him make the second anchor, but hitting with a 5 is too much. Okay, let's clear my 11 point. Okay. He wants to make the low anchor, but okay, 3, 2. So I just hide my blood on the midpoint. Next turn, I have some bad numbers like 6, 1, 6, 2. Okay, this is a good number. Now, 6, 1 is good. 6, 2 is acceptable. 6-3 is bad. Four three. So to play safely, I have to open my 7 point. Yeah, that's the only option. 5-1. 6-2, which is a good number for me. Now, yeah. 5, 3. 3 is not good, but now I can play safely because uh, his goalkeeper ran out. Double 2. I'm gonna finish my bearing in and start bearing off. Yeah, it's a pretty good number, double 2. Oh, double 6. So he has to uh, run out because I have 0 position. That means I have no bad number next turn. Okay, my 5 is not great, but it, it's acceptable because I want to roll a big number. Okay, double 5. Yeah, I admit it is a big good number for me, of course. So now I'm way ahead in the race, in the pip. 4, 2. I have no choice. 6, 5. Okay. I don't want to roll a 2. Uh, actually, this situation is not good. Wow. Still, I continue to roll a 2. But that 2 is... Oh my goodness. I think I'm, I'm the underdog. Uh, maybe it's 50-50? Oh my goodness. Oh wow. Double 5 helped me. Ooh. <laughs> wow, it's thrilling, it's thrilling. Okay, now uh, the score is 11 away, 11 away. So I start with two men down. And he replied with, oh, th this is interesting, 6-5. So I have, of course I have two options. Yeah, I feel making the four point is better. Uh, I'm not sure. With 4-1, okay, he unstacks his midpoint. I like that. I like that. Now, I'm gonna come out. Yeah, I wanna keep uh, my midpoint with 3 checkers. So he's happy to make his bar point. I have many return hit. Okay, it's one of my good numbers. I hit and come out. And he danced. Do I double? No, 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 no. Wow, this is amazingly good dice. It's a super good dice. Now I'm ready to double. 3 1, so do I double now immediately? I think so. I'm way ahead in the race. Yeah, anyway, whatever he played, I'm gonna double. That's for sure. Let double. Let double. Okay. It's a pretty good number. I can hit on the 17 point. 1 5, he can hit back. 2 5, okay. Let's uh, play to the 14 point. So 6 1, yep, pointing on the 2 point is the only reasonable choice. And I'm happy to come out. Okay, he's happy to hit me. 
one six. I don't have many choices. Yeah, eleven to five is the only reasonable choice. Okay. Now, because his back checkers are screaming. Yeah, this is good dice, but which is better? Do I make the nine point or do I come up to the twenty two point? This is unclear. This is unclear. Because I'm ahead in the race, I think come up to the, come up to the 22 point of the priority rather than blocking the opponent. Yeah, I'm ahead in the race. So here, of course, he hit me on the three point and then now his choice is not easy. Okay, so I have to come in with a 4, even though he has many good numbers. Yeah, actually he has... okay, 5-3 is not his best. Then I can come out. So do I go to the 12 point? Or do I stay on the 17 point? That's a question. Which is better? Which is better? If I come to the 12 point, I give him 6, 5, 6, 3, 4, 5, 6 shot. Okay, 6 shot is too many. 6 shot is too many. Double 3. Oh, this is not so great for him. It's a great number. Okay, let's make the bar point. Yep, it's a pretty good number. Double 4 is anti joke, of course. It is anti-joker. Now I wait that he rolls a five, six and leave the anchor. In that case, I have a good chance to win Ganon. Nope, no six. Six two. Is it possible? I think so. Yep, I really think so. Now he left the anchor, but I danced. And he remake the anchor. Wow, what a dice. What a dice. Again, do I cover my two point? I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay. Now any six is bad for him. Oh, I got a shot. I missed, but still any six is bad for him. All right, all right. It's a pretty good situation. So let's attack and make the two point. Oh, he hit back. Double. Okay, I think I can hit him. Can I? Yes. Boom. Boom. And then I'm gonna attack on the ace point. Yep. Double three! What is happening? Oh, it's a it's a pretty good dice. So do I cover my ace point? No. I I wanna uh, I won't get hit with the ace. Okay. Now I'm gonna cover my ace point. Yep. And I want to hit him. Yep, any ace. Come on. Yes. I got him. This is great. This is great. Oh he comes in immediately. I finished my bearing M. Now I'm gonna start my bearing off. Double ace, okay. Let's take uh, f three checkers off. So usually I uh, I need to clear my six point, but because his home board is collapsed, collapsed, uh, it's not urgent to clear my six point. Yeah, my object my objective is uh, winning gammon. Okay, six five. Now he just run out. Yep. So I fear I'm not gonna win Gammon. Yeah, it's almost zero. 
Wow, he's moving very carefully. Yeah, okay. Now my game winning chance is completely zero. But still, it's fine. Yep. Yeah. One, two, three, and four. Okay. Now I have six checkers left. Oh, right. So this uh, double five uh, confirmed my winning. Now I my score is four, which is nine away, and the opponent is eleven away. I start with 5-2. I don't want to play two men down because I'm ahead in the score. If I'm behind in the score, I would to choose two men down. Okay, I just come out. I have no options. Then he makes his 5 point and 7 point. Double 4. It's a pretty good dice. What can I do? If I play 5-11, Probably this is the choice. So it gives him 6-2, six, 6-4, six, double-2, double-4, uh, 6 shots. It's a lot. So in that case, I prefer to make the 2 point. And it gives him uh, 13 shot. 6 versus 13. Okay, I think I have to take uh, 6. Let's do that. Let's do that. So two men down. Yep, sure. Because he wants to make a prime. One four. It's a pretty good number. I'm happy to make my five point. I had option that come up and cover the nine point, but I believe making the five point is superior. Five four. What can I do? Okay, this is only reasonable choice. 6-5. Now he's a favorite because of a nice prime. 4-2. Yeah, I have to make my two point. He, even though he's a favorite, but he... Oh! He filled his four point. Now I'm in a serious danger. Wow. It's pretty bad for me. So I think I have to attack. Yeah, I think so. Two men down is also option, but is it? Nope, I don't think so. I have to attack. And he's gonna double. Do I take it? That's a question. Yep, do I take it? Okay, if he with 11 number and 3-5, He's almost guaranteed to win a game. So, 13. And uh, if he dances with 16 numbers, in that case, I have some chance to win a game. How many games I can win? Out of 13, uh, sorry, out of 16, can I win 40%? Maybe 40%? which is 6.5 games uh, wow I really don't know so probably I will win 10 11 games so my winning chance is not bad but he has very nice game winning chance uh, uh. I don't know because of the score, do I drop it? Yeah. Okay, let's assume he, he's gonna win, I'm gonna win 11 games, which is almost 30%. 30, 30%. Yeah. I don't know, let's take it. Let's take it, yep. Uh, okay, he hits me. Now I'm in a serious trouble. Actually, 1-2 is a good number. Okay. I danced. Hmm. Double 5. So he makes he his 2 point. Oh, really? Oh, that's interesting. 
That's interesting. Oh, I danced. Wow. It's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. Hmm. Wow. He completed a close out. Double three is not good, but still it's okay. Here I have a tremendous joker double six. Nope. Still double six is great for me. Nope. Okay, double five, no problem. But he has six bad numbers next. Six bad numbers. Nope. Okay, now I'm gonna lose Gammon. I think so. But still I have a small, tiny chance to avoid Gammon. Yep, I think so. Yeah, let's try. Let's try. Let's try. Okay. Oh, he rolled one. So now my chance uh, goes up wow this is great this is great dice now i'm the favorite oh no no <sighs> uh, okay yeah anyway so now his score is a six i'm four he is seven away i'm nine away so I, so with six three Yep, my play is basic or basic, split and down. And okay, I secure the anchor on his bar point, which is pretty good. Double two is a pretty good number. So of course, cup making the four point is for sure. And then switching, yeah, switching looks good. I like his idea. Okay, I think I have no option. I just come out. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I could play 137, but here he leaves a blot. Really? Just leaving blot on that same point must be okay. Hmm. Yeah. So I agreed to make the 15 point. And then just leave the blot. Yeah, which is so of course. I'm gonna hit his checker, even roll, even though I roll a one. Level two. So firstly, he has to clear his 15 point. Yep. Okay, he's ahead in the race. Oh, this is, I like this dice. Now, his racing read is only seven pips. Now, 17. 3-1, I slot on my 4 point of course, now he's ahead by 13 pips, and then 5-4, yep, oh wow, it's a tremendous dice, yeah, so can I take a cube, yep, I believe so, oh, double 4, so let's clear my midpoint and then do I slot? I'm not sure. I don't know. Okay. So he's gonna double. Oh, I think he has to double. Yep. And of course my take is pretty easy. Alright, come on. Okay. <laughs> yep, double five is a tremendous dice, of course. So now I have no chance to win this game because he's gonna double and I'm gonna drop. Yep. Okay, let's go to the next game. Now his score is a six away and I'm uh, nine away. So again, my opening roll is split and down. And now he's gonna two checkers which is a tiger play. I come in and he 6-4. So he just cover his bar point and split his backman or he can cover his one point. So which is better? 
Okay, covering and attacking, yeah, it's also a good option. Pointing on? No, I don't like it. Pointing on is not a good option. Yeah, that's interesting. So the question is hitting loose or not? That's a question. Yep. Hmm, okay. He chose hitting loose. Wow, it's a great number. I'm happy to hit him with making the four point. If he dances, no. Okay, three, two. Now I'm the favorite. But I can wait. Double five. Double five. It's a tremendous dice. One, two, three. No. Uh, so one for sure. And then two, three, four. Is that a choice? I was not sure. Double ace. Of course, he's happy to make his fight point. Now, I'm gonna come out. Yep, double four. What's going to happen? I got confused. Okay. So I gave him three shot. So two men down, yep. And do I double now? Maybe because of the race and some shot, five two, five four, two six, six shot. Mm, if I hit him, yeah, probably I wanna lose my market. It's it's an easy take. Yeah, okay, let double, let double. Oh, wow. Yep, I wrote one of my good numbers. Oh, but he hits back. He hits back. Oh, I danced. Wow, I hate it. I hate it. So he can come out. Yep. Whoa. It's another great dice. Yep. I love that. I love that. Wow, he hits me back. And I danced again. No, no, this is not good. This is not good. Wow. Alright. So uh, two checkers comes in, which is good. Six four. He has option to do a double tiger, but of course it's too much. Yeah, just come play. Should be better. Five three. I can come out. Yes, I have to do that. Because I'm ahead in the race. Now, he can't hit me, but he covers his 15 point. 4, 6. Okay. So I have to come out. And then, how do I play a 6? How do I play a 6? That's the real question. Uh, do I play like this? Uh, I think this is simple. Yeah, this is simple. Okay, he hits me. But, 4, 6. So I think I have to attack him. Yeah, I think so. Then, what's gonna happen? Wow, always he hits back. So, I'm very happy to secure the anchor on his four point and do I attack him? Nope. I can make I can cover my three point. Oh three one is not best for him. Now I'm ready to attack him. Wow it's a tremendous dice Wow it's a super good dice now he has to wait 5, 3, okay, of course I'm gonna attack him. No, 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 no. I've never, I've never hit loose. I just want to uh, pointing on. 
That's my wish. 6-3. So let's clear from the rear. Yeah, still I'm way ahead in the race. So I don't want to take any risk. Yeah, I don't want to take any risk. Is it okay? Or I have option to make my ace point. Is it better? Maybe making the ace point is okay. Yeah. So in this case, uh, if I roll 3-1, uh, oh, all right. So let's finish my bearing M. Now I'm ready to take my checkers off. He rolled big doubles, but still he's way ahead, way behind in the race. So he have to uh, stay back. But I continue. I keep my zero position. That means I never leave a shot next. Yeah, because of my zero position. Uh, he uh, popped out. And he wished to win a race. But of course, uh, the possibility is pretty small. Maybe 1%? Maybe. Maybe more? Yeah, I say 1%. Wow. 5-2 is not my best. But still, yeah, I'm way ahead. For one, okay, six four is a good dice, and three two, six three, this is great. Now I have only five checkers. Six two, still here the chance to win the game. Now. He has zero chance. So my winning is guaranteed. So now my score is 7 away. He is 6 away. And he started with 3-1. It's a, Of course, it's the best start in backgammon. I'm split with a 2, not 3. Because of the strong reason. Oh, wow. Double 6. It's a tremendous dice. Wow, my double 6 is also okay. Yeah, so he's not gonna double. He has a better bit distribution. I think I have to make my five point. Yep, and he's gonna double, not yet. He has two options. Okay, I have four shots. I couldn't hit, but I'm very happy to come out. Now, oh, he missed. I'm very lucky. 4-3. It, it's a good dice. It's an okay dice. Because I had some bad numbers to leave blood again. How about the race? Okay, I'm behind in the race. So I'm not gonna double. 4-2. I play like this. I have the option to clear my 8 point. But I was not sure. Yeah, clearing the 8 point has some merit, which is uh, I never leave a shot with 6 1. Now, oh, okay, thank you, 6 1. Thank you, 6 1. Wow, I wrote 6 1. But his board is not critical. Okay, he did hit and cover, and I lower a six. Nope, I think I'm a dead man. Yep, I'm not gonna take it. Oh, okay, he thinks that this is too good. Maybe, yeah, his decision was right. But once I roll a six, oh, okay, I admit, still, it's a tough game, even so, I roll a six. I like his decision that uh, he recognized it. This is too good. Oh, okay. Now he's going to double. Oh, I think. Wow, I got a shot. I got a shot. Nope, I missed. Is it? Ah, uh, 
can I run out to avoid gammon? I don't know. I don't know. Now he's gonna double. Yep. And is it a drop? Probably yes, because of my weak homeboard. And uh, his gamma winning chance. I think it's a drop. Yep. Okay, now I'm seven away and he's five away. Yes, I th I believe uh, lots of people knew that five away is a stupid score. So his situation is not so great. Four three. So he can uh, do a top tiger play. Yeah, that means uh, putting two checkers on the ball. I missed. Now, of course, he makes his three point. Even though he gives me a direct shot. Whoa! I danced. I hate it. Six three is not his best. Okay. I think this is a good dice. The question is, do I make my four point or do I come up to the twenty one point? Which is better? Yeah. Okay. Let's play a. Uh, Let's cho choose an offensive play. I like that. Here, I think he has to cover his ace point, but maybe unstacking is also good. Can I double? No, nope, I don't think so. Okay. Now, 6-1. He has three options uh, popping out, makes a bar point, or cover the ace point. Okay. I missed. I missed. Now the race is e e equal. He wants to make the bar point, but yeah, hiding a blot is mandatory. But still, I have four shot. Here, I have to, yep, leave the anchor. I think so. There is some risk, but yeah, I have to do that. Finally, he covers his ace point. Yep, that what he. Okay, it's a very good dice. Yeah, I'm very happy to make the bar point anchor. Now, but still, yep. Uh, white is uh, the favorite. I have to admit it. I have to admit it. Yeah, it's because of the race. Yeah. He can slot on his two point. Yep, I like that. Yeah, actually, he's a good player. He's a good player. So, he just play from the rear. And six four, so I cover my three point and slot on the ace point. Five three. Okay, now he has bad number. Oh, do I leave the anchor? Do I leave the anchor? Yeah, leaving the anchor is a good option. If I don't do that, for example, this, still I'm behind in the race, but nothing wrong, nothing bad. Maybe it's okay. Maybe it's okay. If I leave the anchor, I give him some good numbers, which is 1 3, 1 4, 6 3, 6 4. Yeah, I think it's too many. It's too many. Hmm. I don't know which is better. Which is better? It's a tough choice for me. Oh, I don't have enough time. Yeah, less than six minutes. Uh, what can I do? And of course, double falcon is another choice. 
in this case one four two four but I'm behind in the race so it seems strange but maybe it's okay maybe it's okay and it gives him less bad numbers oh, I don't know I don't know what can I do what can I do I really don't know okay let's keep the anchor let's keep the anchor Oh, 5 1. So he has to break his 6 point. Now it's time to leave the anchor. I don't hesitate. I don't hesitate. Sure. And then 6 3. So he has an option to do hit and cover. I think he has to do that. Yep. And do I double? No, of course not. Of course not danced uh, yeah it seems drop okay now he's a four way which is a pretty good score okay I copied him by rolling six one and I'm still seven away it's a tough game it's a tough game because my opponent is playing well so here what can I do do I hit loose on the four point or do I split oh it's a tough choice for me I really don't know what can I do what can I do Ugh. I don't know I don't know okay let's hit yep so he hits back and then okay five six is not my best do I come out uh, no uh, I don't want to do that I don't want to do that five four is not his best so come out and 39 is a choice yep so fours are all duplicated it's a beautiful duplication. I missed, but I made my four point. Oh, he made his five point. It's huge. Okay, four five is pretty good dice. I stopped him his doubling. So he can hit, but it's not necessary. Just coming out and uh, yeah, I like that. I like his choice. So four one. I want to split my back man, but I can't do that. Maybe hit and split is an option. Hit and split. <sighs> Looks so bad. I don't like it. I don't like it. So here, does he double? Nope. Okay. So hitting is obvious and how to play a three? That's a real question. one six wow it's pretty pretty bad die so uh, yeah whatever i play he's gonna double and oh he danced and he didn't double really okay wow he danced again Oh, that's great this is great this is great now he comes in so do I double now uh, no I don't think so I don't think so so my gun winning chance is high but okay if I'm white do I happy to take the cube Maybe I'm not so happy. I don't know. So any f any fives, any uh, any sixes are bad for me. So imagine I roll five two. Oh, it's pretty bad. I 
don't think this is double. Mm, my winning gun winning chance is very high, but I think I have to roll the dice. Double five. Okay. Yeah, this is fine. This is fine. It's a fine roll. It's a fine dice. Wow! Double three. His dice is even better. Oh my goodness. Whoa. It's another great dice. Yeah. Maybe it's my best dice? He can hit outside. Yeah, of course. Now. Oh, I danced. I think I'm a dead man now. Yeah. Oh, but any force helps. Yes, 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 yes. Wow. Now he has a 5 prime. 6, 4. So 6 is a force. 4 is uh, nearly forced. How do I play a 4? I don't know. Do I clear my 6 point? I don't know. Uh, I really don't know. Okay. So anyway. Oh, he's not gonna double yet. That's interesting. It seems... Wow! 3 is great! 3 is great! I love this! I love this! And the race is even. So if I roll 6 Im 5 immediately... Come on! Nope! Just 4. Still, he is not gonna double. Mosh mosh. Mosh mosh. Hi. 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 So this. Hi. Okura sama desu. Sorry, I got a phone call. Uh, now, what is the situation? Oh, what a situation. Okay, so I have to roll the dice. So my score is 7 away. He is 3 away. Okay, and my remaining time is only 3 minutes. So, okay. <laughs> it's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. I can run my back, man, but no. I don't think so. His full one is not his best. Now I'm favorite a little bit. But how do I play this 6-4? How do I play this 6-4? I hit and I cover my 9 point? Probably no. Oh, I can hit 2. I can hit two. Oh, I missed. Oh, it's stupid. It's just stupid. Double three. It's a pretty good dice. Yep. It's a good dice. Oh! It's, it's his best. It's his best. I just come out with the f from the four point. Probably yes. I want it to come out from the three point. Oh, it's a good dice. I love this dice. Yeah. Now, 5 2, he can attack me, but he doesn't want to do that. 4 1. So let's slot on my three point. 
now his flexibility is pretty bad so here yep I like his choice I like oh I danced I danced and double free wow it's getting worse and worse it's horrible again I danced double four his position is getting better and better okay finally I came in and how do I play a one all right pointing on yep uh, what a game what a game yeah actually he's pretty good He's a pretty good player. Oh, 2 1. So I think I have to hit. Yeah, of course I have to hit. He danced. Wow, do I double? No, no. Double 5. Okay, I can cover. And I can come out. 2. Three, four. Wow. Now I'm the favorite. I'm the favorite. Okay. Now the game is over. The game is over. This is great. Maybe it's an easy take? Maybe it's an easy take? This. Uh, oh, okay. Alright. Yep. Now I'm six away. He's three away. And my remaining time is. Three minutes. Comp uh, yeah. It's exactly three minutes. Mm hmm. Six five. Let's run out. Let's run out. He can't make the advanced anchor yet. But, of course, my position is pretty poor. Five three. What can I do? Do I make my free point? Yeah, I think so. He can hit me with a 4, but he has to sacrifice his, his midpoint. Okay, it's a pretty good number. I'm happy to make my 10 point. Now he makes his 5 point. And uh, this is not double. This is not double. I'm not so favorite. Yeah, even though I'm far ahead in the race. Yeah, his winning chance must be huge. Do I make my bar point? Maybe. Maybe yes. So he's happy to hit with 4-1, 4-2, 4-3, double 4-4-5. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I think this is better. I don't have strong opinion. Okay, double 5, which is not great for him. Now his timing is suspicious. Do I double now? Uh, double four. Wow, I can't hide my blood. But I can make my five point, which is pretty strong. Yeah, actually, I admit it's a good dice. It's a good dice. Yeah. Now I'm gonna double, of course. And he's gonna drop it. Is it too good? No, I don't think so. Now I'm five away. He's three away. Okay, I copied him and made the three point six four. Yeah, split them down will be the normal choice, but he chose to run run out. Okay, I choose split them down, which is basic or basic in backgammon. So he hits me, of course, and. 
I can't hit back. So of course I come in with a five. Yeah. I don't want to come in with an ace. I don't want to stack on the 24 point. So he covers his four point and hide a blood. Okay, so any four is great for me, but I missed. I missed. Then what's gonna happen? Double two. So he can hit loose. Oh, switching. That's interesting. Switching. Mm. Okay, five is huge. Five is huge. One five. He can come out. Yep. And I can hit, of course. It's mandatory. So two three is not his best. He just come up yeah, come up. And I make my five point. Yep, it's a good dice, great dice. Now I'm the f oh he comes out, pop out. So I have to hit him with uh, any ace and double five, four, six, fourteen shot. Nope, I missed. I missed. I can make the eleven point. Do I do that? Do I do that? I'm a little bit ahead in the race. Is this a good good option? Is this a good option? I really don't know. I don't know. Because I have a better ball. If I don't do that, I just uh, slot on my four point. It looks normal. Looks normal. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, let challenge. Let challenge. It is a challenging play for me. Now he has a better builder. And oh, I couldn't come out. I wanted, I really, really want to come out. Okay, he can't touch me. He can't touch my backman. He chose the slot. And I want to come out. Yep. Ooh. Do I come out? Really? One, two, three, four, like this. He has some good numbers. The race is okay. Let's do that. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Okay, he missed. I got lucky. I got lucky. Okay, wow, still, still I gave him a shot. Wow, okay, he missed. But the race is not good. The race is not good. Wow, yeah. Now his winning chance is 60% because the pip, pip is even. Okay, 5-3, I like this dice. Let's do this. Uh, okay, it's a very close game. Very much close. Yeah. I'm a little bit ahead. A slightly ahead. How do I play an ace? Okay. Now I'm ahead. But my winning chance is like, uh, no, it's not very big. Wow! Okay, I won this game. Yep, I won this game. It's a, it's an easy drop. Yeah, no one would take it. Now I'm four away, which is very good score. I love this. I love this. Okay, of course his double ace is pretty good. Wow. What can I do? What can I do? Mm. Alright. So of course he hits me and he hides a blood. Mm. Wow, he's a very careful guy. So his five is duplicated, but he hits me anyway. And six is thirteen seven. Oh, okay. 
Oh, I danced. It's pretty bad. Now he starts thinking to double. My two checkers are on the ball, and he completed four prime. Oh, wow. And he comes out. Okay. Uh, now it's a too good. It's a, it's a big, big too good. Oh, all right. So here, he's gonna double. Oh, he didn't? Still, it's a too good. Maybe still it's too good. Yeah. Four, three. I can make my four point, but yeah, I think uh, hiding a blood is has a priority because it's a too good. So double two will be my best dice. Wow. Now he completes a five prime. Yeah, because his score is three away, so yeah, winning Gammon, uh, getting two points is pretty good, good for him. Mm. Uh, it's a tough game. Okay, let's come out. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Let's come out. Yep. To so avoid gammon. Yeah, avoid gammon is my priority. Okay, five. Yep. Now I have only two back back men. So my gammon losing chance is not uh, too big. But still, it's like a twenty percent. Yeah. Oh, double six, which is pretty bad. Yeah, it's bad. Yeah, but uh, my opponent Edward is—he's a very good player. Yeah. Yeah, his PR must be very good, very low. So. Finally, he completes a bearing in. He finished. Okay, six two is good. I love this. I love this. Five one, six one. So I have to come out. Yeah, to avoid gammon. Okay, now his gammon winning chance is very much low. All right. So I'm happy to give him one point. Now, now it's the most exciting score in backgammon. Four away, two away. Yeah, I'm very aggressive to offer a cube. Okay, but still, uh, I'm the I'm the underdog, so I can't double. Oh, I feel he gave me a chance. Yeah, he gave me a chance. Nope, this is not great. This is not great. Okay, 3 2 is not his best. So I have a, a couple of good numbers. 5 2. So 5 is almost forced. And how do I play a 2? Do I hit? No, I think come up has, is a priority. 6 1. So he has multiple choices. This is interesting. It's not easy for him. Oh, by the way, I have only one minute left. So I should be very careful. So any twos, uh, six one, four three, six five. I have a couple of shots. No, I missed. I missed. I hate it. Still, I have some shot. No, uh, yeah, he can complete. Yeah, he can. Let's say completely safely. So, uh, do I come out? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe coming out was better, but I I was not sure. So double three. Say okay again. Oh wow! I don't know. Again. This time I think I have to come out. Yeah, I think so. And I wish he doesn't roll any fours, twos, but 
by four. Okay. Three and do I come out again? Do I come out again? No, not anymore. Not anymore. Double three. It's a tremendous dice. What a dice. Okay. With which number do I come in? With a two? I, I'm not sure. Okay, I have to take care of my time because my remaining time is just one minute. So here. Okay, I got a shot. Yeah, five four. Come on! Oh! I rolled 5-4! How is this possible? Okay, now I'm gonna win the game. Really? At this score... Uh, but I think I have to double, yeah. Yeah, it's a double. And is it a take? Okay. Wow! What a sequence! Now the score is 3 away, and he's 2 away. So again, I can for a cube aggressively but not like uh, the one before 4-3 so let's make the three point yep because he has a dynamic position he hits back and I can hit him of course I have a stronger home board so once he dances I can offer a cube all right he secured the advanced anchor, which is pretty good. I also make the 16 point. He makes his bar point. So he improving his position. Do I make my 5 point? No, I don't think so. The race is equal. Oh, again, double 3. <sighs> okay, it's a good number. Yeah. It's a good dice. Yeah, I'm very happy to pop out, and he missed. Oh, but my position is very, very unstable. <laughs> very unstable. I have stuck the two outfield point and stuck the six point. Okay, let's play safely. Let's play safely. Wow. This double three is. Uh, is not joker it's not a joker wow i like his choice yeah. he's a really good player so how do i play 4-2 okay i have to play just safely or i could clear my eight point i was not sure okay i can hit him but of course no it's too dangerous. It's too dangerous. Double two. Still, I got a shot. But, do I hit him? I doubt it. I doubt it. Now, he's gonna double. Oh, he didn't? Oh, he didn't double. I'm surprised. Now he's gonna double, not yet. Really? Okay. So. Oh, he didn't double again. It feels very strange. Yeah. It must be a clear double. Yeah. And uh, I would drop. I would drop. Okay, my remaining time is one minute. So he thought that's too good. Okay, he thought that was too good. Maybe he's right. But was it too good? Really? Was it too good? I doubt it. Yeah, anyway. Probably it, 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 it was not a big deal. 
it was not a big deal okay so now he got uh, a Crawford game and I'm three away so if I win a backgammon yeah I will win a match so winning backgammon is huge for me uh, but winning gamma is nothing so I believe he has to make his five point instead of the anchor oh okay yep six five he can play safely five three okay okay let's leave a block oh it's a great dice he's happy to make the four prime six two I want to come out no uh, I can wait I can wait I can improve my uh, uh, homeboard my inner I can make my inner point here do I play like this it's possible it's possible who oh, I, I can I can make my bar point okay let's make my bar point three two so he can choose two men down yep double five all right okay now I want to come out oh six five is a tremendous dice so here I have to roll okay so let's split my backman and cover my two point yep so I have to move forward wow he makes his four point and cover here I have a four shot oh no oh he completed close uh, full prime wow oh my goodness oh my goodness I need to make the anchor let's roll an ace okay still I have a chance to make the anchor ah. now he completes a close out yep okay my, now here my winning chance is two or three percent yeah, very low but still it's possible here his uh, flexibility is bad so my winning chance is higher oh I don't want to come in I have to dance okay and then no it's a tremendous good dice okay I have to admit I'm gonna lose the game so how do I resign how do I resign I don't know I don't know yeah anyway yeah he played very well he played very well yeah he's a pretty good player mm. so yeah I enjoy the match okay <laughs> again my PR is bad <sighs> anyway yeah so congratulations Edward yep and thank you for watching the video yeah. I wish you enjoyed uh, uh, my talking and my checkup play cube actions and uh, his performance yeah. if we if you like it please subscribe my channel now I wish you a good dice and good life bye <laughs>